Tip ranks 3. Strong buy. Stocks with 8% dividend yield. Let's talk portfolio defense. After last week's social flash mob market manipulation, that's a topic that should not be ignored. Now, this is not to say that the markets are collapsing. After 2% losses to close out last week's Friday session, this week's trading kicked off with a positive tone, as the S&P 500 rose 1.5% and the Nasdaq climbed 2.5%. The underlying bullish factors, a more stable political scene, steadily progressing COVID vaccination programs, are still in play, even if they are not quite as strong as investors had hoped. While increased volatility could stay with us for a while, it's time to consider defensive stocks. And that will bring us to dividends. By providing a steady income stream, no matter what the market conditions, a reliable dividend stock provides a pad for your investment portfolio when the shares stop appreciating. With this in mind, we've used the TipRank's database to pull up three dividend stocks yielding 8%. That's not all they offer, however. Each of these stocks has scored enough praise from the street to earn a strong buy consensus rating. New Residential Investment NRZ, we'll start by looking into the right sector, Real Estate Investment Trusts. These companies have long been known for dividends that are both high yield and reliable, as a result of company compliance with tax rules, that require rights to return a certain percentage of profits directly to shareholders. NRZ, a mid-size company with a market cap of $3.9 billion, holds a diverse portfolio of residential mortgages, original loans, and mortgage loan servicing rights. The company is based in New York City. NRZ holds a $20 billion investment portfolio, which has yielded $3.4 billion in dividends since the company's inception. The portfolio has proven resilient in the face of the corona crisis, and after a difficult first quarter last year, NRZ saw rising gains in Q2 and Q3. The third quarter, the last reported, showed GAAP income of $77 million, or 19 cents per share. While down year over year, this EPS was a strong turnaround from the 21 cent loss reported in the prior quarter. The rising income has put NRZ in a position to increase the dividend. The Q3 payment was 15 cents per common share, the Q4 dividend was bumped up to 20 cents per common share. At this rate, the dividend annualizes to 80 cents and yields an impressive 8.5%. In another move to return profits to investors, the company announced in November that it had approved $100 million in stock repurchases. BTIG analyst Eric Hagen is impressed with new residential, especially by the company's sound balance sheet and liquidity. We like the opportunity to potentially build some capital through retained earnings while maintaining a competitive payout, 